So the question has been asked, when do I use sine, when do I use cosine, and when do I use tangent? It's very important when we're looking at the right triangle that we understand the importance of what information we're given. If I am given this angle right here, let's say is 22 degrees, and I'm told that this segment here is 12, and I want to find this length. And what I have to identify is what parts of the triangle do I have? I have an angle, I have the adjacent side, and I have the opposite side that I'm trying to find. So therefore, when I go to my saying, so ka toa, in this case, since I have the adjacent side, and the opposite side, O and A, goes with the TOA, T-O-A. So therefore, in this problem, I'm going to use the tangent of 22 degrees and set that equal to the opposite, which is X over 12. As a result, in order to solve for this, X is going to be equal to the tangent of 22 times 12. So x would be tangent of 22 times the 12. And again, from here it becomes a calculator problem. If I take my calculator, and on my calculator, I type in the tangent of 22, and I hit enter, that gives me 0 0.4040. And then I'm going to multiply that times 12. When I multiply that times 12, that gives me a length of 4.84 approximately. So I could say my answer for this one, x is equal to 4.8.